Okay, guys. So, as someone who is more shabaning limba, or shabaning the an identity crisis, what are the first steps that you should take? Now, first steps for me are you yourself must speak on behalf of yourself. Where neutral location, meaning not at your father's place, not at your mother's place. Eshane. Normally, the healers will tell you this. Or somewhere out in nature where you'll be safe. Obviously, show them maybe spaces that allow them to align and connect with the people in those amounts of time. So as you go and as you navigate the spiritual path, you know the things that serve you. What do you then do? How fit are there? We'll go by an intimate conversation. Lebona, we'll go by beats and neutrally. Bitsiding a little Kanya from your mother's side and your father's side. Ingelos with Kanya from your father's side and mother's side. You call them forward, no sinners. How so by Bita, Obata with them, Obata Obajreza Hori. You are now conscious of the fact that Nia Bango and Njomo Bango Bango, it's affecting so many aspects of my life. You can mention those, right? And now you've become aware and conscious of the fact that you need to embark on a journey, but you don't know how. Perhaps you're there, right? You want them to lead you. And maybe you've seen someone like myself who's then giving you like a basis of how to move going forward. Now, this basis for me is normally to bring you back under your mother's side. So your mother, in the case that she's alive and in the case that she's with this thing. If she's not, then you get someone else who's under her family, right? But why partly is that about a why rapidis? In that what you want those who you will engage around this matter to have open hearts, na? Then you go and you speak to them. Once your mama partly, and she's done it for you, out Lisa, what will she say? Tabi tadi ngelo ita ha ita khanya from her side and tell them about you as their child and how you want to be protected under chirele choya bona and not this context you're going through a right now. There's this tug of war. And then you speak about the people from the father's side that if they want you, they know where to get you. Let it be that little hand, little look is in the right way. Now, all of this is pivoting around the person who's going through it, representing themselves through consistent prayer. Once they've done that from the mother's side, we do the same from the father's side. The father or representatives from the father's side, with the intent to make their people aware that the intention is to come and fetch you. Na? Spiritually. Once they've come to fetch you, from your mother's side, then they'll come but Then it will be however you guys ritualize in the connection process, whether la shaula, shaula la beha, whether la lobola, however it works for you, but make sure everything is done in consultation, lay your prayer space, or engaging with your people, neutral space, consistency in that process. Then from there, it will unlock itself step by step. Once this thing connects, then it will allow you to tap into other things of your path. Then we can focus on intantayako, then we can focus on your spiritual gift, then we can focus on what is blocking you externally from the fact that you, there's balance ancestrally, you know? Shab. If you want to purchase herbal medicine from us, you can come visit us in store or you can purchase online. All our details are on screen right now.